See, adversity, my father often said, is very big when it is all you can see. But it is very small when in the presence of all else that surrounds you. People, and this is naturally instinctive, I think, people tend to look at adversity through a telephoto lens. They zoom all the way in until there's nothing in the frame but the problem. When you zoom out, you find that the circumstance of adversity is often paled by the opportunity surrounding you. So step back, take stock, see around the problem. Adversity may make or break you, but primarily adversity reveals you. Adversity reveals you. In the midst of adverse circumstances, the one who creates and sustains good fortune is the one who allows adversity to clarify reality. In this way, adverse circumstances are like a new lens. Perhaps they clarify something about ourselves we've overvalued. Or perhaps they clarify a strength we've never employed. You want to see beneath adverse circumstances by acknowledging the opportunity for change. But do not fall into the trap of believing that desperate times call for desperate measures. Not that it's not true. Sometimes drastic action is required in uncertain times, but too often the phrase desperate measures is taken to mean reacting in desperation rather than taking appropriate and reasoned actions that may seem drastic. While adverse circumstances are for most an obstacle to be overcome, they are, for those who apply the principles of earning good fortune, an opportunity to make positive change. This tool of change is more powerful than constancy if it is wielded properly. But it is not enough to simply see beneath adverse circumstances and merely acknowledge the opportunity to change. You see, without strategy, my father explained to me, cambio es solo sustitución. Change is only substitution. So step back and give yourself room to act rather than react. Don't jump at the first opportunity without evaluating your circumstances for what other opportunities may be awaiting for what other opportunities may be awaiting. You see, this is a surefire way to lose the momentum of good fortune. And, and lastly, see beyond the adverse circumstances. See, the one who has learned to see beyond adverse circumstances understands, above all else, regret is a waste of time. He or she does not therefore allow her eyes to become lazy. Opportunity doesn't wait to be noticed. Like a sunset, it is striking for only a moment then it's gone. So, 